Christ. But that day what was the most extreme and terrifying day of my life in the eight months and one day is the worst time in my life. Now at 11 tonight marks one year since the October 7th attacks on Israel. Ceremonies are being held around the world, and one of the hostages taken by Hamas that dark day will share his story of survival here in L.A. Good evening, everyone. I'm Gio Antonio. Hi, everyone. I'm Susie Sa. In tonight for Leslie Marin, a somber ceremony at the Museum of Tolerance tonight. Thousands of candles were lit at the exact moment Hamas fighters invaded Israel and slaughtered 1,200 civilians. KCAL News reporter Lori Perez was at the ceremony. Organizers say this was an event to remember the loss, but also to unite in hope for the release of nearly 100 hostages who Israel says remain in Gaza held by Hamas. You can see we are here in the courtyard of the Museum of Tolerance where in one of the most striking moments, 1,100 candles were placed, lit in honor of the victims of that day. The candles were 